Today I'm sharing with you how to get Hermes brand new and on sale. I learned an interesting trick and I'm not going to keep it to myself. So if you want to know my secret, stay tuned. <music> YouTube, Autumn Beckman here. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My channel is all about luxury living on a budget from high-end luxury handbags and small goods to the everyday luxuries of life. If that sounds interesting to you, please make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification icon to be notified when I post new videos and be sure to like the videos that you enjoy. And one of the perks of subscribing to my channel is you get to see my community posts on your YouTube homepage where I post deals, discount codes, sales, and rare finds related to these beautiful things we love. Now in this box, I have two Two items from Hermes. They are brand new, like factory packaged, crisp clean. There's nothing pre-loved about them, but I didn't buy them directly from Hermes and I got them on sale. And no, they're not like from eBay or anything like that. I'm going to unbox them for you and then I will tell you where I got them and how this company is able to offer brand new Hermes at a discount. But before anything else, I have to mention that the person who told me about this tip was Dawn of Dawn Loves Couture here on YouTube, one of my YouTube friends, and this video is in collaboration with her because she also purchased some Hermes items. So as soon as you're done watching my video, please go head over to her channel, check out her video to see what she got. Her video will be linked below. All right, let's open this up. I've already cut the tape on it. And I've actually, to be perfectly honest, I've already peeked at these items because they arrived last week and I was out of town for the weekend, so I didn't have any time to film and I had to open them up and see them. I also had to do like a legit check on them because this whole thing was just like too good to be true. I didn't wrap them back up quite as well as they were packaged when they arrived, but there are two Hermes items in here. Here's one and here's two. And yes, they do even come in Hermes packaging. Here's my receipt. Now this is not the packaging you would get from Hermes if you were to purchase directly from them. These items would usually come in a box. Instead, these are sent in plastic sleeves to keep them nice and safe. And then I'm gonna cover up the sticker that tells you what they are. But they've been sent in these orange paper sleeves, these envelopes. And you just open that up. On the boxes that these come in, there's some writing inside the box that gives you care information. And this has that care information printed on the back of the envelope. And inside is the item and it is also wrapped in plastic. And here it is. Can you guess yet? I'll come closer. Here it is up close to give you a better look. And you just open this up and it is indeed a brand new Hermes scarf. I'm gonna go back now so I can open it up, be able to show you the entire scarf at once. Here it is. This one is so beautiful. Well, they all are. Hermes scarves are amazing. All right. This is a 90 by 90 centimeter, brand new, authentic Hermes scarf. This design is Equator. I'm saying it the American way, but it's spelled differently. And then it, that's at the bottom of the scarf. At the top, it says Hermes Paris. It has the tag there that says made in France, 100% silk, and the care instructions on the other side. And I'll give you just a little sweeping glance of the scarf here, just so you can see the whole thing. Um, up close a little bit see some of the artwork. I'm going to give you just a tiny bit of information about this particular scarf. One thing that's special about it is that it's a wash scarf and that means it's been through a process which makes the silk softer and more pliable. The brand new silk scarves from Hermes are typically kind of stiff. They're not like super stiff You'd have to feel them and compare them to other silk to really understand what I mean, but there's a stiffness and a, almost a crunch to them. And then the wash scarves are made to be softer and more flowy, straight out of the box. They're also designed to be washed in the washing machine, which I probably will never do, but now you know. What Hermes says about this design is the equatorial zone of South America has remarkably diverse fauna and flora that is a marvelous source of inspiration for the passionate naturalist Robert Dalle, who's the artist of the scarf. Around a jaguar, the solitary big cat that prowls dense forests, a whole population of wild animals busies itself. The ocelot and the marguet, small felines, sharp and keen, dominate the scene and frame a spider monkey, a sloth, and toucans. Then comes the ballet of the macaws, parakeets, and a cock of the rock, followed by the white-headed capuchin, the woolly monkey, and the ringtail. On the ground rest roseate spoonbills, a sun bittern with its wings spread, and a scarlet ibis. 
a composition of multiple voices. I do tend to be very much drawn toward the scarves that have animal and nature motifs, so of course I was drawn to this one. They actually had a few different colorways of the scarf available from this reseller. I'll tell you about that reseller in just a minute. And I had to go with this turquoise, did I not? There's another one that's in another really pretty shade of blue with yellow highlights that I'm still considering getting. I'll also tell you what I paid for these in just a minute after I open this one. So you probably guessed by now I purchased two scarves. This one is very special because it's a highly sought after scarf, one that tends to be quite expensive on the pre-loved market. And I couldn't believe they had a brand new one, not only available, but available at a discount. You can see it's very bright colors, which is not usually my thing, but which this scarf kind of requires. It works really well with it. Although it also comes in colorways that aren't so bright. Are you ready? This is the Animopolis scarf. A very famous design in exquisitely bright colors. This is not a wash scarf. This is Hermes's regular crunchy, stiffer silk. I'm gonna come closer and do a little drive-by thing so you can see the details on this a little bit better. The tags on this one are a little bit different because these scarves were released in different years. This scarf is newer than the other one. So this has the fabric tag in the back there. It says, made in France, 100% silk, and then the care instructions on the back. But then it also has the paper tag that if you have purchased new from Hermes you're familiar with. It has the Hermes logo on one side and then the barcode on the other with the information about the item. This scarf has a contrast hem, in this case in yellow, and it is a cityscape full of animals. You can see there's this big pink monster. As we go down there's this one building that's in the center of everything. You saw it there. There's an orange jaguar and there's the bottom of that central building. And there's just so much detail in the scarf. I really love it. I, I love the animal scarves that have the nature in them, like I mentioned, that are more realistic. But then I also love some of these more illustrative designs that have so much detail to look at and so much color. I tend not to be drawn toward the scarves that have people in them. The animals are really the way to go for me. Now for the information you have been waiting for. How did I get these brand new authentic Hermes items on sale? First of all, what did I pay for them? Retail on the 90 by 90 silk scarves right now is $480 just for a regular one with no frills. I got each of these for about $378. So about $100 off retail. That's a pretty huge savings at that price point, and especially for brand new authentic Hermes. And they do have other scarves, and they also have other items from Hermes. They have perfumes, they have, they have a few small leather goods. I remember seeing a scarf ring. Where did I get these? I got them at Joma Shop. Have you ever heard of Joma Shop? Dawn told me about this. She sent me and a few other YouTubers a link to Joma Shop and said, look, they have Hermes and it's on sale. And I went and looked at it and it looked authentic. And I'm wondering, you know, Hermes doesn't really put things on sale except that sale that they do like once a year or so in Paris that you have to be there in person for. They don't discount things on their website and they don't have outlets or anything like that. And they tend not to sell through other retailers too. So how is this happening? Well, I did a little research and based on what I found, it looks like Joma Shop is part of the gray market. I'd heard of that before, the gray market, the black market, but I never really looked Looked into what those were and what they mean. So of course the black market, that's something you want to avoid. There's really shady stuff going on there. That's where you have counterfeits and things like that. And that's where you have a lot of illegal activity. The gray market, however, is legal. And my basic understanding here of this some of you are going to know a lot more about it than I will, and you can put more details in the comment section if you'd like. The gray market is, in this case, where a retailer like Joma Shop can purchase, in this case, Hermes items overseas where they're cheaper. Like, this stuff is going to be cheaper in Europe because they don't have all the import fees and shipping costs and all that, right? So they could buy these Hermes items over there at a lower cost than what we pay here, and then they bring them over as an unauthorized retailer. So Hermes 
Hermes doesn't sell directly through Joma Shop. Like that's not an agreement that Hermes and Joma Shop have. This is just something that Joma Shop does on their own. They buy it cheaper overseas, they bring it to America where the prices are higher and they're able to sell it at a lower price here and still make a profit because they paid less than that for them. Now, I don't know all the details of that, but that is my overall understanding of how this works. And again, it's legal. These are brand new items and they're authentic. Joma Shop has not only Hermes, but lots of other things. It appears they have a lot of watches. That seems to be a big specialty of theirs. So if you're into watches, that's a place to go look. The Animopolis scarf is no longer available there. Those did sell out and I have since seen some of them on eBay. Like I said, I paid $378 for that. I saw somebody on eBay selling them for over $1,200. That gives you an idea of how popular that Animopolis scarf is. And that's a colorway that's difficult to find as well. The equator scarves are easier to find and not as expensive as the Animopolis. This scarf in this colorway is still available at the time I'm filming this on Joma Shop and they have it in a few other colorways as well. And there are also other items available. They have a couple of 140 centimeter shawls. Those are usually about $1,200 retail and they have them for about $900. They're not going to have a huge selection. It's more like a handful of things. I think I've been checking multiple times a day, every day since I since Dawn told me about Joma Shop, and the selection hasn't changed much other than a couple things have disappeared. For the last few days, they've had 33 scarves, for example. So that gives you an idea of the vast array of Hermes scarves. There are 33. They're not current season. They're gonna be past seasons, but they're still brand new and authentic and beautiful as Hermes scarves are. So that's my secret. And if any of you know other places to get great deals like this, brand new authentic items from major design houses on sale, please let us know in the comments. Share your secrets too so we can all benefit. And I will tell you, I have been very into Hermes scarves again lately. I've been into silk scarves before and I'm back into them now. And I have purchased several of them. So you'll be seeing more scarf videos over the next few weeks and months. This is just the beginning, folks. I also plan to do an Hermes scarf 101 video where I give you some information as I've been learning about the scarves again to help people who are newer to the scarf world and I'll do some styling videos on how to wear them. And let me know if there's anything else you would like to see about the scarves. Oh I can also do an authentic Hermes scarf versus a fake one because I have one that I got on eBay that I didn't even know was an Hermes design when I bought it and I've since discovered it is and so I can compare those for you. But yeah let me know if there's anything else you'd like like to see about scarves and I will make note or include it in a video I'm already planning. Please make sure you go watch Dawn's video. I don't even remember what she purchased from Joma Shop so I'm excited to go watch it as soon as I'm done. No, I don't watch my videos so as soon as it goes live, I was gonna say as soon as I'm done watching my own video which doesn't make sense, but as soon as it goes live I'll go watch hers as well and I hope you join me there. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye.